Hello, and um, today I'm going to be reviewing The Heart of Fadi or Oracle um, by Brian and Wendy Froud. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing their names right. I don't usually leave the prices on um, because I don't like people to, um, oh, I'll peel that off later. I don't like people to go, oh, my local person's selling that cheaper or whatnot. And I think it's a bit unfair because I buy from all sorts of different places and I do buy from local sellers and they do do it a bit more expensive when I buy locally but this I don't think you're gonna find much cheaper or as cheap anywhere else and if you do fair play I got this in a bookstore here in Ireland actually one in Dublin that has decks on a pretty regular basis random decks I will say and um, relatively cheap so this is Brian and Wendy Froud, the heart of the fairy oracle. Um, originally marked, ooh, ooh voiding who's selling at twenty thirty. And um, basically, what they do is they buy in these in huge amounts, and when they don't sell them, they just get rid of them really cheaply. Let's open this one up. I have to say, the first thing you know is when you pick this box up is it's pretty heavy. And hard to open. There we go. Let's just have a look at the back before I open up. Um, from the creator of the best selling The Fairies Oracle comes a long way to follow up the heart of The Fairies Oracle. From the acclaimed artist Brian Winfrey. So there are some cells. The Heart of Fairy Box contains 68 Oracle cards illustrated by Brian Fred. An accompanying guidebook written by Wendy. The package features many enchanting fairy images. Da 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 da. Brian Fred's international art. Yeah, yeah. Let's just spiel about them. Let's get to the money shot, the cards. Oh, okay. It's a pretty sturdy box. And would you believe it? A lovely hardback book. Wow. That's, um, yeah. That, I was not expecting that. Um, the end is the beginnings. Tarot spreads. Well, Oracle spread, I should say. Wow. That's... Hmm. 62, the hope. Question. Hmm. Interesting. So again, that's Brian and Wendy Frow, the heart, um, the heart of Fairy Oracle. How the Wisdom of Fairy Transforms Life and Relationships. Um, I did pay nine euros ninety nine for this, which I mean that's really nothing when it comes to decks. Okay. Now Let's try and get this off without damaging the car. Should be too hard. There we go. Lovely. Okay, first things first, cardstock is very thin. Um doesn't feel particularly cheap, but does feel very thin. Okay. So we'll go through all the cards. The Queen of Golden Ball. Okay, there's gonna be a lot of reading to go with this one. The Queen of Bedlam. Hmm. Love the artwork on the Queen of Night. The Queen of Day. The Queen of Passage. The Queen of Owls. The Queen of Heart and Home. The Queen of Shadows. Um not really sure why these big numbers are in the top because it's not like they're um, tarot cards and you just look at the number and you go, oh, this is... Anyway, the Queen of Laughter. The Captive Man. Hmm. Doo -doo -doo. The Prince of Shadows. Prince of Light. The Speaker of the Truth. It's a very devilly looking person. Which would fit. Shapeshifter, the Eleven Knight, the Messenger, the Rocks, the Thief, 
Lord of the Forest. I actually have a statue of Lord of the Forest. Um, bum, bum, bum. The Lady of the Forest. Boy. The Maiden. The Heartless Love. The Child. The Hero. Um, the cards are se are actually separating very well. Um, no issues there. The crone. The sorcerer. The magician. Hmm. The green man. The green woman. The smith. The fairy of view. Fairy of growth. Think Bright Spark Star Fairy The Fairy of Naughtiness The Pan The Fixer The Lady of Leprechauns The Lady of Unicorns The Lady of Song The Lady of Sorrows The Lady of Faith The Lady of Joy The Juggler Big Ben. Okay. Pick up your ears. Um, oh no! The Hidden One. Into Minds. The Paradox. The Blessings. The Leaving. The Remembrance. The Challenge. The Joy of Future. Shadow of Past, the song, the question. I'm trying to think of what style this is in. It reminds me so much of um, some sort of cartoony drawing from the um, is it Labyrinth? Am I thinking of the Labyrinth mo no, movies? Temptation, the hope, the dreaming, the gift. Um, I'm loving some of these cards. Some of them I'm not too hot on, but a lot of them, I mean, if they were selling them as posters, definitely frame one. Do, 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 do. No names on these cards, actually. No. Turning at 65. 66, 66, hmm. Um, yeah, the last three. The wild cards. Hmm. Mushrooms. Take that as you will. And um, back of the card is quite nice. Same as the back of the book. I think a lot of so well, a lot of these are just the ones you're gonna have to read up on. Um But do do there are a few that are blatantly obvious what they are. Um but yeah, it's 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 a nice size deck in the hands. It really is. It's a nice size deck. Um, as I said, the card stock's a little thin. Well, no, it's not a little thin. It's very thin. But you know, I I've seen worse on tarot decks. Overall, the quality of the card itself isn't bad at all. Um, box that comes in great. Um, hardback book. Hmm. I think this is the sort of book you take out and you leave it on the shelf because the cards, I don't think they're going to stay in this box very long. It's, um, yeah, it looks a bit awkward for getting a loose deck out of. Um, hmm. so I think this is more of, I'll have to find something for the cards to live in. But yeah, that's, that's a pretty nice deck. It's the heart of Ferre. Hoodie, Oracle, and um, by Brian and Wendy Froud. Um, yeah, definitely worth the nine ninety nine I paid for it. So click like and subscribe.